Hello everybody, Patty here. I'm gonna do a little tutorial here about creating your preview fo image for HSD. So uh, let's first rewind a little bit. Um, I'm an IL-2 player. Uh, it's a very awesome game and inside the game you can also have the option of creating your own custom skins. Uh, so you can use to create a skin uh, Photoshop or GIMP. I use Photoshop. Uh, if anybody knows me in real life, uh, you would know that I am not a very artistic or creative person. But <clears throat> over the last three months, along with playing the game, uh, I've gotten a little bit into skinning myself. So I'm going to maybe do a couple short tutorials. Uh, kind of from a beginner perspective on uh, tips and tricks I've learned along the way in Photoshop on creating your skins. So um, maybe some nose arts, some paint and colors, uh, and maybe around the alpha channel. But there's also tons of material out there already from some very experienced and awesome skinners uh, on these topics. So I'm going to try to keep it short videos and uh, more kind of from a beginner perspective, just stuff that I've learned because, yeah, I'm not a professional, but I've learned these things uh, just over the past couple months and I wanna pass, pass some of that along. Okay, so here we are. I would like to upload a skin to HSD. This is the skin server and app for IL2 that uh, some members of the community have put together it's a very awesome app you can uh, find skins from basically any group that plays the game any uh, any aircraft uh, it's very cool very awesome so thank you guys and here in the upload screen <coughs> for your preview image your maximum size can only be 200 kilobytes, this resolution 960 times 540, and the file must be uh, JPEG. So let's see, let's go over how to do this. So I'm going to open, so here's my screenshots from the game. I've played the game, ran a mission on Combat Box, and I've created my screenshot. But how do I get this image? that I want to use as a preview image for HSD. So the first thing I'm going to do is, instead of trying to edit the size and muck around with everything in Photoshop, I'm just going to take a snip of it with the snipping tool from Windows. So just around the aircraft, the size I want, or whatever I want to be included. And I'm going to save that on my desktop. And it's going to automatically save as a JP, JPEG. So I don't know, we'll just name it one, whatever. Okay. So now it's on my desktop. So now we have to do edit the size and the quality to match the specs that HSD is asking for. Because it won't be valid if, if I don't do this. So we're going to open it with Photoshop. I have... Photoshop number two. It's a very old, I think, version. I'm sure lots of guys have much newer versions. But I got this for free from one of my squad mates. So thank you. You know who you are. All right. So first step. Image. Image size. So 960. And then the other the maximum is going to be 540. Photoshop is already just applying the ratio so at least I'm below or I'm within the, the limit so 960 466 sure okay so it's gotten a little smaller now we're gonna save for web and let's try I want to keep the quality as high as possible because inside the app if you degrade the quality too much everything starts to get a little fuzzy so no good. You want to keep quality high. So let's try with 90. And 
I'm going to save it, save it over, and replace. Okay, so now my file is saved on my desktop and it's a JPEG and in the proper dimensions. Let's just check the size. Oh, actually, I nailed it. So, 200 kilobytes. So, basically, and a 204 on disk. So, maybe I need to make it a tiny bit smaller. But, anyways, I could probably take this and now use it as my preview image uh, for uploading to HSD. Oh, I'm starting to open another program by mistake. Get out of here. So, that's it. That's all you have to do. I hope you found this helpful. Talk to you later. Bye.